Hi, I'm Dr. Yami, and I hope that you're having a fabulous day. Today's question comes from Hannah, who asks, do vegans really need to take vitamin B12? The answer is a resounding yes. Vitamin B12 is an essential vitamin that is produced by bacteria. Generally, these bacteria are consumed by animals and then they multiply in the gut and they create special enzymes that are able to produce vitamin B12. And then that vitamin is absorbed into the muscles of the animal. Now humans do this too, but in modern day, it happens in very small amounts and is not absorbed very well. And even for humans that do consume animal products, after the age of 50, older adults tend to not absorb the vitamin as well. And so most multivitamins do contain some vitamin B12. Why do we need vitamin B12? It is important for the production of red blood cells and is used by our nervous system as well. Deficiency can cause anemia, tingling of the hands and feet, fatigue, and other neurologic symptoms, some of which are serious and can be potentially irreversible. But the good news is that for those of us that consume a completely or mostly plant-based diet, it's really easy to avoid vitamin B12 deficiency. Vitamin B12 is used to fortify many foods, including some plant-based milks, nutritional yeast, tofu. However, the best way to ensure that you're getting adequate vitamin B12 is to take a supplement in the form of cyanocobalamin. Now vegan moms who are pregnant and who plan to breastfeed should continue to take their vitamin B12 supplement during pregnancy and breastfeeding. But babies born to vegan mothers should begin supplementing right after birth. To simplify the dosing, I have the following recommendations. For children eight and younger, I recommend 500 micrograms three times per week. For children nine and older, I recommend 1,000 microgram three times per week. And for adults over the age of 65, should be taking a daily dose of at least 500 to 1,000 micrograms per day. Now for families that find that a daily dosing may be easier to remember, then you can just do 250 micrograms per day. Vitamin B12 comes in the form of chewable, sublingual, tablet, and liquid forms. And it is best to take on an empty stomach for maximum absorption. There is no upper level of vitamin B12 that is shown to cause toxicity. And luckily, the supplements are very affordable. So it's really not a bad idea for all humans to take vitamin B12 as a supplement, but it's especially important and essential for those that are eating a completely or mostly plant-based diet, and especially for people over the age of 50. Keep the questions coming and remember to visit VeggieFitKids.com for more tips, recipes, and helpful links. I'll see you next time.